Oh, that's a brown. <gasps> I never got fish like this before. Wow. This is amazing. <laughs> Welcome back to another Fishing Webers video. We are on another adventure. Uh, we're going camping to some place in Mysticata. And right now we're just gonna step by, get some food, kinda hungry. Should have eaten before we left because now it's lunchtime, it's really busy. So we are stopping at Burgerville. Yeah, Burgerville is based in Oregon. Um, they have really fresh burgers and um, they use uh, the cheese they use on the burgers is from Tillamook factory that is in Tillamook, Oregon. If you haven't been to a Tillamook cheese factory, it's uh, it's a really neat place. They make their own cheese and cheese curds and all kind of fun stuff. So if you are in the area, I would definitely recommend checking out Tillamook. So yeah, we're gonna grab something to eat. Gonna head out, probably gonna do some fishing first and then we're gonna get to our camping spot. We did find a camping spot, which is surprising because it's super busy everywhere. It's hard to find any places to camp around. So we found a spot um, in the area, in the Estigeta area. So yeah, um, hopefully it's gonna be a fun trip and hopefully you guys enjoy. So stay tuned. And uh, we, if we catch a fish, we're gonna do catch and cook. So I'm looking forward to that. I wanna eat some trout. So we're gonna grab some food and I'm gonna be on our way. We made it to our campground, already set up the tent and everything. Gonna just take a little break and probably gonna go to um, Herit Lake. So we were wanting to fish at North Fork Reservoir, which was on the way to this camping spot. And the place got pretty busy. There were already people swimming in the water, bringing their rafts and battle boats and all kinds of stuff. It did not work out as we wanted to. Plants changed a little bit. Are we gonna go try to fish at Herit Lake, see if we can catch some trout and hopefully I'll cook it tonight for you guys. Guys, we got a fish. Oh, that's a brown. I never got fish like this before. Look how beautiful it is. Oh my gosh. This is gorgeous, you guys. I'm kind of like tangled up in here. I don't know if we're allowed to keep this one. Oh my gosh, look you guys. We never got anything like this before. Look how beautiful this fish is. Had a bite, you guys. Got a nice brown trout. Um, wasn't sure if it was brown. Um, we we're worried it was a bull trout because you can't keep bull trouts here, but there's no limit on browns. So if I'm catching another brown, I'm keeping that. All right. So we're using worms. The worms work great. Let's get you another fish. I might just keep one fish today to um, to cook it for breakfast. That is so awesome.
Oh, maybe, I don't know. My drag is really loose. Am I getting something in? Oh no, just, yeah, I got a, a stick. <laughs> awesome, Jig's getting a fish. Is that another brown? If it's a brown, I'm gonna keep it. Ooh, that looks nice. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh my gosh. Hold on, hold on. I'm keeping it. I'm gonna fillet this trout. Um, we don't have much time left at the campsite. We have to get out in, the, in a couple hours. So I'm just gonna start filleting it. I filleted um, bass before, but not um, trout. So we'll give this a, a go. Never had brown trout before. So curious how it's gonna taste. Look at the color on this fish. It's a, it's so awesome. That's going to taste delicious. Slimy. Oh my God. It's really slimy. <laughs> Can't hold on to it. Awesome. Beautiful fillet, you guys. I'm gonna make a breakfast. So I'm using some breadcrumbs and chopped rosemary. I'm gonna dip my fillets into it. It's gonna be so delicious, you guys. Can't wait to try it. All right, now I'm gonna Use some breadcrumbs, dip it in it. This is like a gourmet camping food. <laughs> I bet this is gonna be so amazing. Let's cook these bad boys. Those are actually pretty good sized fillets, you guys. The fish was 14 inches. Oh, it's small. And the fish is done. Look at this beauty. So pretty, can't wait to try it. I'm gonna try it in a little bit here. Oh, I'm so excited, never had brown before. This should be good. It turned out really good. First piece. You know, in um, since I'm Ukrainian and we have a saying, um, whenever you try something for the first time, you have to make a, a wish and it's supposed to come true. So what am I going to wish for? Get my brown? <laughs> well, you're not supposed to say what you wish for. I'm going to make my wish. Become good. And let's give it a try. Oh, my God. Wow, this is amazing. Wow, mmm, yeah, I love it. The best breakfast, for sure. 
I'm so happy with this. We went, we got our own fish, cooked it. This made my day. Yesterday we didn't catch anything. It was so slow, but today we caught a fish. So you guys, we are done with our little adventure. Had a lot of fun. Um, yep. We were lucky enough to find this camping spot. Everything is booked, like I said earlier. Um, this summer has just been really crazy, you know, whatever we go fish, it just gets really packed, but um, You know, we never caught anything in Harriet before. I think I got like a tiny trout, but we actually caught some brown trout this time Yeah, some good size ones too. Yeah, and the first time uh, the first one we caught um, I wasn't sure if it was a brown. I, I kind of thought it was uh, but we just like yeah we better just check our regulations first before we keep it or do anything to it so we let it go and then i was like man there were no more bites no more bites I'm like are we gonna catch another trout because i want to cook something you know and then jake happened to reel one in and uh but before that we checked regulations the good thing he had a regulations guide on his phone and we looked at photos you know read the regulations it says you know you can keep any browns and no yeah we're debating so the, uh you can't keep bull trout so the are catch you, you can't even uh target for bull shot i guess so if you keep if you catch a bull shot you have to let it go right away Right. So we weren't quite sure if it was a bull or a brown. We so we had to check and make sure. We and they good. have a sign for cutthroat trout that said uh, it's. Um, it's encouraged to release them to, unarmed. Yeah. yeah. So we were we just wanted to make sure we weren't doing anything we weren't supposed to, and that's why we let the yeah. first one go. Ended up catching another one, kept it, and that's what. We yeah. Cooked. So that was a brown, and it was so delicious. Um, glad I got it to cook it, and uh, so yeah. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, we had a lot of fun. It was fun editing everything. So um, yeah, stay tuned for our next video. And as always, thank you so much for watching, for subscribing. You guys are awesome. We love you all. We'll see you later. Bye. <laughs>